<laughs> Welcome back, folks, to Fishing Planet. I'm Super Dave, and today's guide is going to be on the St. Croix Exploration Mission. And if you do have any issues with these in particular, there is a playlist in the description for each individual fish, but I'm going to show you the quick way for people trying to rapid fire uh, this mission. Uh, so we're going to start out with the uh, yellow perch, and you're going to want to go over here to St. Croix Lake, uh, Vanishing Rock Light Spawn, and you're just going to cast anywhere in particular out here, um, and, and go ahead and do stop and go near the bottom with the worm, and you can see here, uh, if you want to mark for it, at 194 to 31.5 you guys can pause the video if you want that any word worm, worm will work though for these guys and then we'll go back for the dock here and for the bullhead what you're going to want to use is a cheese on a bottom rod or if you're using a float pole like 90 inches or 250 centimeters with a one all from dusk till dawn and you're just going to go ahead and cast right here to that mark. I will show you that mark here in a second. And then with the uh, with a full pole with blood worm, semolina balls will work too, 20 inches or 50 centimeters down. You're going to catch the rock bass, the golden shiner, and the green sunfish here with the bullhead as well. And I will show you the marks here if you guys do want to see them. And you can pause these and put these in a... Um, your map um, but or just fish right in this area uh, it doesn't have to be uh, one spot in particular and you can see the golden shiner is here as well now for the last two we're going to go ahead and switch bond and we're going to come over um, to uh, this spot here we're going to walk down to here uh, but you can see the marks here, bottlenose minnow, you can use semolina, but same pole that you use for the green sunfish. Um, and you can catch both of these here, anywhere along these reeds for the most part. But a lot of times I'll just go up to this dock and then cast out along these reeds for your other ones. And like I said, if you have any particular problems with a, one of the fish, there is a guide for each individual one in the playlist in the description. Anyway, guys, hopefully this helps you out. We'll see you next time. Have a good one, folks.